Hi students, in this video you are going to learn about chapter 13 continuation. Read a specific column in your file. So, so far enna paathirpinga or CSV file create pannadhuk apro complete a ebdi read pannadhu abdi innaam paathu. Here now we are going to see uh, particular columns alone how to read from the CSV file. So, that only you are going to see here. Uh, to get the specific columns like uh, only item name and profit so only two columns uh, we are going to view here for the sample file.csv file so here we have the sample python program first we have to import csv file then we have to open the file by using open function then we are using a read file is equal to csv.reader so here we are using csv.reader function then we are we are going to printing the selected columns so for that we are using the print print col that is a column of 0 comma col means column of 3 so then f dot close so here with the help of the for loop we are displaying the particular columns value so now the exec after executing this program the output look like this is so actually the out the csv file in the form of a excel so excel file in the number na pandro select pani edukro so here four columns we have actually we have four columns but we listed only two columns so, so like this we can do with the help of python program next we are going to see read a csv file and store it in a list or csv file read panna the kapro other list formula number store pandro in this topic you are going to read a csv file and the content of the file will be stored as a list the syntax the syntax na list is equal to rend square bracket kutturkanga so start as the empty list so initial on the list empty irukano empty a irukano list dot append inside the bracket element they given use append to add elements append up, append function edhuk use pandranga abdina we, ha we want to add the elements into the list. So, adding the elements kagada in a pandranga, append in the function use pandranga. For example, all the row values of sample.csv file is stored in a list using the following program. So, in a file use pandranga, sample.csv. In the file larka values sadana manna panaporo, read pani, list la store panaporo. So, first we have to import the CSV file. Next, we have to mention which file, path we have to mention. Next, we are going to open the file. Next, we are using the reader function. Next, we are declaring the array. So, with the help of the array, we are getting value from the user and displaying. So, displaying the content of the list for row in reader, array value dot append. So, enna pandranga? Over a data as a CSV file in the read pani and the array la store pandranga. So next we are going to see the output of uh, this program. So if we, if we see here, uh, the normal program it looks like a table. So we are going to read the list formula store in the list formula. Array use the list formula store in the list formula. So inside the square bracket we have all the data. So it looks like this. So it is a list of data. A list is a data structure in Python. So Python is a data structure pathing na list. So that is a mutable or changeable ordered sequence of elements. So list elements change panikla. Then it, it, we have the data in the order. Okay, so we have ordered sequence of elements in the list. List literals are written within square brackets. So list like items within a square bracket. So it is a similar to strings also. R read a CSV file and store a column value in a list for a sorting. Next in a number values are read pani and the list la store pani the number sort panro. In this program, you are going to read a selected column from the sample six dot csv file by getting from the user the column number and store the content in your list. In a manna panaporo, user kit in the end the column number and a number input wang it and the column number sort pani display panaporo. We are going to see the sample program 
so that broke them we have the that in the form of a excel so that data we entered in the form of excel since the row get sorted so row heading kuda namba vandu sort panna vaippu irukka but we want to avoid only the data so to avoid that the first row should be skipped anala enna pannana first row skip pannenum this can be done by using the command next so first row va skip pandradhukku enna use pandranga next abindra command use pandranga the list is sorted and displayed so here one simple program they given sort a selected column given by user leaving the header column so enna pananum i want to sort out the data but i want same time i want to leave the heading heading include panna koodadhu so first we have to import the file next we have to open the file path we have to mention next after mention the path we want to open the file then with the help of reader function we are reading the file so inga pathina next reader abdin kuduthirukanga so that means it is skip the first row that is a first record next declaring a list so inga enna pandranga list vand empty list declare pandranga next a is equal to int of input enter the column number so with the help of this line we are getting input from the user which column you want to sorting you want to sort out so we are getting the column number from the user so after get the column number we are using the for loop to display the values so ipo inga pathina enter the column number 1 2 3 so one. actually Uh, three columns we have so the user need the second column so two abdina avanga kuduthirukanga so that's why it list out at the second columns in the sorting order so idha pathina sort panni display panirukka but it is in the descending order next read a specific column in a csv file and display its result in descending that is a reverse order reverse order la pathina inda output vandu display a irukku list underscore name dot sort command arranges a list value in ascending order list name sort reverse is used to arrange a list in descending order so list name dot sort command in the command use panninga abdina so it displays the value in ascending order ascending order la display pannu list name dot sort reverse in the function use pannaka idu enna pannu list oda values a descending order la arrange pannu next we are going to see sorting a csv file with a specified column in this program we are going to see the sample 8.csv files entire content is transferred to a list whole content enna pandrom list ku transfer pandrom then the list of rows is sorted after that adavadhu uh, entire content list ku transfer pannadukaprom we are sorting the rows and displayed in ascending order of quantity so then we are displaying the displaying in ascending order to sort by more than one column you can use item getter with multiple indices operator dot item getter so that is a one comma to the content so now we are going to see the program so here we have a two columns and a four rows so here three rows only we have the data so we are going to see the program so we are going to use this function here operator the item getter column number so we have to mention the column number so here one program they given import csv then we are importing the operator also so program to sort the entire row by using a specified column declaring multiple header files so here we are declaring multiple header files so one is a csv another one is a operator so data is equal to csv dot reader so with the help of reader function we are reading the csv file next function we are using to omit the header that is the column order heading omit pandradhukku next function use pandrom next we are using sorted list is equal to sorted data comma key is equal to operator dot item getter of one so one specifies we we want to sort according to second column so second column la ne enak vandu sort pananum second column mattum na sort pananum adukku thaguna mari first column oda data so enak varum appdi na inga solren so with the help of for loop we are displaying the data see the output mouse keyboard monitor if so here we arranged the second column data according to that first columns also arranged
the sorter method sorts the element of a given item in a specific order ascending or descending so with the help of sort method we can arrange the data either in ascending or descending order sort method which performs the same way as a sorted one only different sort method does not return any value and changes the original list itself so sorted ku sort method ku enna difference na sort method it won't return any value and it change the original list original list yo change panidu add one more column cost in sample 8.csv and sort it in descending order of cost by using the syntax sample 8.csv la one more column i want to add it the same time i want to arrange it in the descending order so adukana syntax kuduthirukanga sorted list is equal to sorted data comma key is equal to operator dot item getter so here we have we, ha we need a column number then reverse is equal to true so this is the coding to add a new column same time to arrange the values in the descending order that's all children thank you